Good morning. We've arrived in play. I'll speak to you when we get off this bus. Come in. You okay? <laughs> Bags inside. Hello. Welcome to Huey. We got dropped off at like a little hostel there, and we're about. I've just looked Google Maps. It our plate. Our hotel is about four minutes walk away, so that's handy. Just down that road. We're gonna go and see. It's half past seven, so I'm pretty sure we'll be able to check in. But maybe we can just go and dump our bags just chill out in the lobby or something for a little bit or I don't know, go and get some breakfast although I'm not really hungry. Are you hungry? No. No, I'm not hungry. I don't know, we'll see. We found our hotel, pretty easy. So at the hotel we're just in the lobby, I'm just catching up on a little bit of work. Stephen's chilling over there. It's like 8 o'clock now, she said that we'd be able to check in the room in about an hour or so, so not too bad. So she's given us some water and some bananas, so that's all good. <coughs> No. No. We're in our room, that didn't take long at all to check in. Oh, I could think, oh my goodness, it's so nice to be on a bed. I think I might just have a little doze for a bit. I don't know whether a doze or a shower or an explore, I'm not sure. Not an explore. Not an explore well, right now. Oh, you're not? <laughs> okay. We've got a little cute heart here. I don't know why, but yesterday when I woke up, I didn't say, look, can you see this? Bruise here. I've got like bruises on the inside of my thighs. Yes, and I've got one up here. I feel like it's like somebody's just. Did you see that? It was like somebody. I feel like somebody had just been punching me in the night. I don't know. I've got like another one on my stomach. I don't know where they're from. It's a mystery. We're all showered, changed, all clean. And we are back out. We're going to have a little wander. Possibly head to the Citadel. So thank you. Um, I hope we're heading in the right direction, I don't really know to be honest. Uh, it is raining, it's actually due storms the whole time we're here. I just had a look on the um, on weather and it says rain and storms, 100% chance, 100% of the time. So that's excellent, we've got our jackets out with us. We thought it was raining when we came, so we just ran up back upstairs to get our jackets. But it's not actually raining at the moment. gonna have a little wander in I think to get in to the citadel we're just kind of wandering around aimlessly i think i think it's this way i don't know found steven's type of place tanks and war stuff we found this really pretty nice gate we thought it was the way in but no it's the way out only it's exit only we went to go in and was like exit only I think we've got to go all the way around. I don't want to say it's something Afraid I'm going to make it true We'll be lying in the pieces I've got enough to lose Here's the entrance. Oh no! That's not funny. It is. I just, I just stood in a huge ass puddle. She was laughing at me. Right, let's go. Look, there's two entrances. One for Vietnamese and one for foreigners. International. 
Wow, look at all the fish we're finally in. There's tons of fish down here. You like fish, don't you? I don't want it all Whoa. You can feed the fish if you want. Get a bag of food for 5,000 dong. Still awake, nothing seems to shine For better days, what will we leave behind? You're making me choose, but I can't lie Leave me where I'm alone for another time It's like a little scale model of the Citadel and it is Kind of like the Forbidden City. I was reading something that said it's kind of like the Forbidden City. When we first came in, we were like, it's nothing like the Forbidden City in Beijing. It kind of is. So it's like a vast open space. There's those, like little palaces, and little buildings, and temple things, I think. Me and Stephen are just having a little bit of a moan. It's too hot for sightseeing. It's not, I mean, there's, actually, there's a nice breeze now, but just a minute ago there was no breeze. And even though it's not sunny, it's just humid and I'm not in the mood for it, to be honest. Are you? No. No, especially after the, um, after the night bus. We're just wandering around the outside of the Citadel now. Honestly, I'm just, I'm so weary. I think we're going to head back, slowly wander back to the end. Um, to the hotel, I think I need like a power nap, a little hour snooze or something, and then we're just gonna relax for the rest of the day to be honest. Have a little nap, do some work in the hotel, and then maybe head out for something to eat later on because, yeah, I'm just not up to much to be honest. I'm like walking around like a zombie. It's Halloween tomorrow, actually. We need to sort something. I wonder whether we do anything Halloween y in Huawei. I have to have a little look. We were originally, we were going to go back to Hanoi, do you remember? Yeah. We thought about maybe going back to Hanoi to have Halloween there, but we're here instead. There are some very angry looking clouds over there. I think it's going to absolutely piss down in a second. Everybody's stopping their bikes to get out their, um, like their rain mat things. We haven't got any waterproof with us. We didn't bring anything waterproof with us, you know. That was a bit silly, but we're all right. We'll be all right. Okay, no, I'm not making complete content, but it's keeping me dry. Look how miserable it looks. Cloudy. Hey. I need to go. It's, it's. I'm getting so cute. It's like really starting to film now. Um, it's starting. No, we're gonna get soaking. We are soaking. <laughs> lasted like two minutes or so we're back at the hotel I've just been sitting doing a little bit of work and oh my goodness check out the rain there's so much rain oh my goodness this is not good it is look at it that's not what we wanted all this rain that's no good, I've just been sitting there so I've just kind of finished my work and I thought, oh I'm getting quite hungry. We could go out and bored to be honest. And we could go out for something to eat. We can't go out in that. We might be hotel bound. No! Yeah. It's been so nice in Cat Bar. It's not like I've got a burnt mm -hmm. face in Cat Bar. Shut this door. This is our little balcony thing by the way. <laughs> it's like... There's no, it's not an actual balcony. 
Oh, we should have stayed in Cat Bar for a few days. I wonder if it's nice and sunny there. This is rubbish. We don't want this rain. I've just come to nip out the fun to see actually how bad it is because you can't really tell from that little kind of. It's not. I'm not even going to call it a balcony. Um, and the uh, woman has lent me an umbrella. That was kind of a. It's bad. Really bad rain. Oh, look what I found though. Vegetarian restaurant. Hmm. I think what I might do actually, now when we've got an umbrella, is go back, grab Stephen, and we might go and get some food, go and sit somewhere, get some food, get a drink, I can't stay in the hotel for the rest of the day, no way. You'll take us to spa. Ah, oh, is that a Sparky? Ah, oh. Sparky. I'll oh, just gonna like go Sparky. Ah, oh, hello, push. I'll have them. Sparky. Sparky. Oh, he's not our friend anymore. Oh. Such a day. What? What? How many hours now are you in front? What time is it here? Well, we, yeah, we're, we're seven now, aren't we? So we're, we're quarter, past, quarter past four. Quarter past four. Quarter past four. Because we were six, <laughs> weren't we? But you've gone, you've gone back today, have you? Ah, because we're lucky over this trip. I love you, Sarah. Um, hello. Oh. What about me? Hello. 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 Bye bye. Bye. I love you. <laughs> bye. Pop in, Stephen. Love you. Hey. Oh, she's kissing the bone and hugging it again. Bye. Speak to you soon. Bye. Have a nice breakfast. Bye. bye. See you later. Gone. That was nice, just had a little FaceTime chat with the family. My sister is up from Wales visiting my mum and my sister, so spoke to almost everyone apart from my little sister and her boys. That was nice to have a little chat with them all. They're going out for breakfast at Weatherspoon, which Stephen would like to be going to, wouldn't you? Yeah. Yeah. He wants some American style pancakes from Weatherspoon. I don't. I want to be where I am. <laughs> to be honest, we're going to go out for tea now. We're seven hours ahead of everyone back at home because the clocks went back last night in England. I didn't know that it didn't happen all over the world. Is that really stupid of me that I didn't know that? But I would have to Google it yesterday when I saw something on Facebook that someone was saying about the clocks. I thought, oh, do the clocks go back everywhere in the world or is it just like in England or where is it? Anyway, gonna get ready, go out for tea. Hopefully it stopped raining. We found our restaurant, Risotto. Italian and Vietnamese food, it does. Happy with this choice of place? Yeah. Does it smell nice? Yeah. Oh, we got some free bruschetta. Nice. Are <laughs> you looking forward to this? Yeah. Look what's just arrived. Mmm. What? <laughs> Hot. Look at that for dessert. Some passion fruit. So nice. And of course, another beer. Yeah, I'll try this. Try it. Try it. It might be the nicest thing. Careful. You don't like it. We finished our meal now. We're just gonna head back. We contemplated maybe had a little wander, a bit of an explore, but we are kind of. I'm not gonna stand in it, don't worry. We're still. Look. No, we're not going to go for any sort of wanderings or explore tonight. We're just going to slowly wander back to the hotel. I've got some work to do. We're going to have an early night because we're up early tomorrow for a tour that I've booked, which I'll explain more tomorrow. It's Halloween tomorrow. We're just talking about it. I really want to go trick or treating and dress up and carve a pumpkin, but I don't think it's going to be possible. Anyway. I think I found somewhere that has a Halloween party going on tomorrow and tonight by the looks of it. Oh. See, look, another 
fire. I don't know what they burn. What do they burn? I don't know what they burn. It's like on the side of the road or in their fields or whatever. They just light fires and things. What do they burn? Do you know? Paper. Like said, like rubbish from the day. I don't know, I think maybe they're rubbish from the day or something. Look at that. Anyway, I'm going to that place for Halloween tomorrow. You coming? No. <laughs> no. No. We need a costume. We need a costume. We've got a stick. We've just got back to the hotel and look, our laundry has all been done. Did I say that we were getting all our clothes washed? I don't know whether I said or not. Yes, but I've put all of our clothes apart from the things that we had on. Everything else and our towels and everything I've put for laundry this afternoon when we arrived. That's like some quick service. All done, washed, cleaned and back to us because they were starting to stink a little bit. I hadn't had them done since Hong Kong was the last time they were all laundered. So I don't know what that was. And mind you, they've been being um, washed whilst we were staying in Hanoi with their washing machine. Anyway, they're all done, all clean, all nicely smelling again. I'm going to end it here because I'm just going to do some work and chill out for the rest of the evening. And then tomorrow we are up, we, our tour leaves at half past eight in the morning. But thank you for watching today. I hope you had an awesome day, whatever you did. Steven, say goodnight. Good night. <laughs> Good night, thanks for watching. Bye.